Welcome back. Now we take your questions. If you have a question yourself, send it to us at QuranSpeaks.com. So Dr. Shabir, um, our viewer asked, people say that the Quran has contradictions, uh, but what, where do people come up with this? Do they take it out of context, and can you shed some light on this? Mm -hmm. Well, we can say uh, categorically that there are no contradictions in, in the Quran. Uh, there may be some passages which appear to be in some tension with some other passages, but people uh, draw conclusions based on just a superficial reading, and they think, okay, this contradicts that. Uh, but when we examine the verses carefully, we look at the context in which each verse appears, um, we take the Quran as a whole, uh, we, we see that in fact there is no uh, real contradiction between them. Uh, if I give a, a case in point, uh, some passages say that the, Quran, uh, the heavens and the earth were created in six days. Uh, one passage in Surah 41 uh, seems to indicate that there are eight days, and, and that, it, that apparent uh, indication uh, comes from adding up the numbers which are mentioned there until you realize that some of the numbers overlap. And once you omit the overlap, you realize that that too is referring to the six days of creation. One part of the book has to be interpreted in, in the light of the rest of the book. Uh, but if uh, clearly one passage said six days and another passage said clearly eight days, then you would have a contradiction. But that's not what you have in the Quran. Thank you, Dr. Shabir. You're welcome.